I thank you so very, very much and enjoy the show. As soon as I give the speech, I'm gonna leave and I am not going to return. That is their show to do. Whatever happens, they have to take care of it. Otherwhere. Come in, Tangiers, come in. This is solitaire. Somebody, anybody, isn't anybody there? This is solitaire. Going down for emergency landing. Making emergency landing approach to the Whoa! After that, I climbed a high mountain. I have students that are very, very heady. They have their hands stay close to their bodies, they don't move very much. Then you have your feeling people and they're like everywhere, constantly moving, and then they sort of like hang places because they just live here, right? Then you guys wait one more, then the randa, wait one more. And then there are the doers, and they say, I don't want to think about this, I don't have any time, you know, let's just do it. What do we need to do? You know, I'm bored sitting here, we should be moving. So you take all of those people and you say, oh no, all of you, you all have to work together and you have to use all those different parts of yourself. I'm a fox. Will you come play with me? Nice scarf. Nice day. It was a gift from my mother. <laughs> no one needs to be a great actor or actress. That's not what we're looking for here. It's that you're willing to join in, that you're receptive to new ideas, that you're willing to work with a group, that you're willing to take really whatever job's given to you and, and do that to the best of your ability. Every year we have a few students who either don't feel comfortable with the group or they don't want to do a play or, you know, whatever it is. And it's so interesting how the group, like, sort of folds them in and says, it's okay, like, we understand, you're not happy, we get it, but like, we're a class, we, we have to be together. So I think that's what theater is, is asking a human to use all of their parts. You have to use your head, your heart, and your hands, and that's the only way we'll get this done together. One, two, three. Just like the little prince learns that his flower is ephemeral. My flower's in danger of speedy disappearance? That's why it is. The, the play is ephemeral as well. It doesn't last. Oh, well, we cut that part of the scenery and we didn't do this and there was supposed to be a dance there and like, you know. <laughs> it's, it's done. There's no do-over. That's a great lesson for everybody. You know, it might not be perfect, but we're gonna make it as good as we can, and we're gonna present it, in a sense, give it as a gift, and then we're gonna let it go. I'm tame, I'm finally tame. Every student who stands uh, at the end of a play, I think they're filled with pride. They all, like, come up, like, a lot, you know what I mean? sort of found their legs and found their voices a little bit. They take away the knowledge of who they are and where they fit in that moment in time. And they take away a greater sense of community. That's one of the parts of doing plays here that I love the most. They know that they're meant to do it together.